faith is knowing that God, everything works out for the greater good. And so if he has you in a waiting season, it's because he is refining you. He's molding you. He's taking you through the fire. He's purifying you. Okay, so we got everything that I need. I got my sister a water pick for her birthday. I wanted to be more intentional. I know she talked about this for the longest and actually wanted one. And I just got her one from Target and I'm gonna get it in a little bag and maybe one of her favorite snacks or something for her to take on her trip. And I had to get me some like personal hygiene stuff. I was running low on toner. I needed some soap. I want to start back getting, of course, the antibacterial soap because that's always good. And some more mouthwash. And like I said, of course, you guys know I gotta have my high chew. Yo, I think this man really thought I was African. Like he just started speaking some kind of language. I don't know what the heck he was saying, smiling and saying something to me. I have no idea what he just said. I need to do an ancestry test to see what I am because I feel like I got, you know, we all got a little African in us, but I feel like I got something like I'm a little island or something. And then, I don't know, I could be Dutch, who knows? I don't even know. I gotta go take that test. All right, y'all, today is the day. I'm about to get busy and get this room together back clean. I washed everything, just have not been able to fold or put anything back. But we just got back from church and I wanted to show you guys something. I'm super excited because, like I said, I'm getting ready to do all this. But you see my pants, like these, I did not think I was gonna be able to get back in these pants. They're a little tight now after I wore them for some time, but you can see they fit really good. Like, I got back in the pants, so that's a good thing. Now, I know, I've been losing a little bit of weight, so once this comes down just a little bit more, it's gonna feel even more comfortable. But right now, I gotta take these things off because it's just a little snug. It's not like super tight, like I can keep going with the rest of the day with it, but I just don't want to. I'm gonna put some shorts on, we're gonna get some music going and get everything back because I feel like I kinda gotta like, Reset, let me get away from this before. I feel like I gotta reset, get my room together, get things back in order so I can start waking up, doing my uh, studies, and then my course study, as well as just getting everything back in order. Like I said, the editing, all that, I got my glasses. So we're gonna be on a roll. I gotta get some meal preps to get myself together, start going back to the gym. Whole long list of stuff to do. But yeah, first things first, you can't do anything where I can't do anything with the cluttered space, unorganized, all that. Got to do all that to get a clear head, and then we'll be back to get busy. Because I do want to try a new recipe today, hopefully today or not, but that just reminded me, I got to go take that chicken out the fridge. All right, y'all, I'm in the process of getting ready for an event at my church, but I'm like, you know what? I've been trying to wear different stuff, and I don't really have an outfit to wear, so I'm going to go ahead and try to clean these up and see if it makes a difference. Normally, I'll take the laces and everything off, but today I'm not, just because I'm in a crunch. I gotta pick up my nephew and stuff and we gotta head out of here. But um, yeah, let's see if this works. I've done a video on this before. You guys can check it out if you want. It's still on the channel. I didn't think about it, hopefully it will dry. I should've probably took the laces off, but you know what, we're gonna work with it and see what we can do. Hopefully it'll air dry in this heat a bit or just not get it too soaked. I don't know if my eyes are deceiving me or if it's lightening up already. Not the best lighting, but it's getting it done. I'm nothing like the opposite of holiness was what I was, but I'm to you. See my soul and could you see why? Hold my hand high, could you see why? So y'all remember the last video I said we were gonna clean and organize. I'm actually getting rid of a lot of this stuff and getting ready to see my inventory. So we're gonna straighten all this up a little bit. You guys will not believe the expiration. Y'all, I lost out on some good vitamins. I can't believe this. I'm not even gonna show y'all the date, but yeah. Let's continue to get ready. I got my girl Leah playing to get me going through this. And we're going to knock this out quick so we can see what baking stuff I have. Because I never even organized any of my baking stuff in here. It's looking crazy. and bone of my bone she shall be called woman it was all woman when you saw me real people in this room 
Soften up the mess Drop it in the water Let the daughter find an image with the rest She'll be learning how to breathe Spinning through identity Reveal another pretty little scheme Save her mind Hold her hand And don't believe a lie You understand me Walk her down the valley Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach Like the angels do And you gon' make it through now Tell about the healer Greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky And I'ma wait upon the giver He'll deliver like a dealer to take her Y'all, I feel like I'm looking super crazy right now. If you guys are following me on my channel, you guys know I've been doing a little series showing you guys my natural hair care. And as you can see, this is the day after the wash. Like I said, some days I just don't feel like doing my hair all the way. I was gonna wake up this morning and do it, so I put it in those little twists and I forgot I can't go out the house looking like that. I wanted to get myself a quick little workout in this morning before I get my day started. I'm gonna head over to Planet Fitness again. I don't know which location I'm gonna go to yet, but I'm gonna head over to there because I've been enjoying some of the machines that they have different than my complex gym. So we gotta get a quick little workout in. I gotta run back to Target again because I realize I'm running low on my facial cleanser and I just went and brought some products. So we have to go back there and Bath and Body Works because the, I don't know if you know Wallflowers, I believe it doesn't matter if you don't have the receipt or not or if it's open. I think it just can't really be fully used, but the Wallflowers, you can return them and kind of like exchange them for another one. So for me, there's certain scents that trigger my asthma bad. And I'm finding out Mahogany Coconut is one of those scents. I absolutely love it, but I can't light the candle. I had the Wallflower in my bathroom. I think it made my chest like tight and kind of like hurt a bit I don't know if I got a headache or not but it just like tightens my chest and I unplugged it and realized I felt fine after that I tried it again like weeks later in my mom's bathroom the smell was still coming out in the room and making my chest feel that way so I know that's one of those scents that I just cannot use I absolutely love it but I can't and it's weird because I think I had it in my car the little car fresheners they have and I don't think it bothered me so I don't know it's like certain forms of it I guess but we're gonna run there and also exchange that get some products some more wallflowers and all that for the house so we can get it nice and smelling good but yeah let's head to the gym get this quick workout in because I do have to come home and study before I go to work so yeah we got a pack day today Day two. Alright guys, I'm back. I haven't recorded much after the whole hair thing. Right now I just got it up in a claw clip. I'm outside. Hopefully you can hear me because of the wind. But going for a walk, it feels so good outside now. I don't know if we're starting to hit fall. 
the summer people are mad because they says it doesn't start till September 22nd. That's a lie. We're getting started with pumpkin spice, everything. The weather feels good. It's starting to cool down a lot, so you know that means a lot of outside walking and exercising. I got Miss about Sonia here. Hey, y'all. We're going for a little walk to keep us active, and you can see she's walking. Your girl has her covered out of the boot, everything. So, you know, we're just trying to keep up and be healthy, make better choices, and walking in this little area feels amazing. There's like a lot of trails that I want to oh. go. Well, you stop. No, it's recording. Oh. You know it. <laughs> There's a lot of trails that I do want to visit here in like Northern Virginia. So I thought maybe we can make a little series out of this. Now that the weather is getting good, we can actually enjoy these walks. But you guys know how it is with my allergies and the asthma. Doubled up on my Zyrtec this morning. I'm gonna do my Navage when I get home. But I'm definitely pulling this mask back up. And it's gonna be super loud because we're coming to the main road with traffic. So enjoy some B-roll. Okay, y'all, so we took a detour on the walk. I feel like I didn't even look you guys in the eye and talk to you guys, but we took a detour and found a park over here, and I thought it was just soccer fields this whole time, but there's a whole complex and other stuff. I wonder if that's a gym, and there's like a playground, and one thing to mention too, these soccer fields are turf. I always see kids playing, I don't know if it's football and soccer, and they always have like games here, I guess on Sundays or whatever, like a little league, but I didn't know it's turf, so I can come out here and run laps and everything. I see a guy doing lacrosse, so you can do lacrosse, soccer, whatever. And I'm trying to see what else they have. It looks like actually football and baseball. Is there basketball? I wonder if there's a track, there's like a playground, everything. So we're just trying to discover new things. Take a break, deep breath. Relax, take a nice walk, and look what we discovered. Yes, that actually looks really cool. I'll show you guys everything when we get close, but you guys know I gotta put this mask on. I know it feels so good. But what kind of bird is that? It looks like a hummingbird, but it looks different. It's yellow. But I don't know if you guys can see it through the fence. It's really cute. I don't know what's on. This see, it's another one. Same color? Yeah. He flew into the grass. But that's a sign that there's a lot of nature. That means I need to put this back on. So I can breathe. Um, you wanna just walk this way? Cause there's no cars. Yeah, that's a lot. That's actually pretty cool. No, you had it. Did that one? Mm -mm. Nope. Start off with another. No. Ma. Yeah. They're a little off key. You do it then. You didn't have to do all that. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> Uh, no, G. It'll work. Mm -hmm. Ooh, cool your head. <laughs> okay. DJ Sun Ski. Wait guys, what is there a weight capacity for the swing? You know how long it's been since I've been on the swing? Hmm. Adult supervision recommended. You saw that? Yes. Oh, okay. I'm definitely and I'm definitely over the weight capacity. Yep, I'm not breaking no swings today. Definitely overload. <laughs> Yo, look at this from five and below. This is like a cool little aesthetic. 
their posters you can hang on the wall and make like a collage i'm trying to see the sizing so it's a six by eight so they're kind of like small in a way but yeah that'd be super cool and they had different ones but i actually like this one all right since we're going back to the field tomorrow i got me a speaker soccer ball and a mouse pad that I needed for my wrist. But yeah, I'll show you guys in a sec because I'm like balancing this with one hand, struggling. All right, y'all, so this is what I got. I had to get one of these because I'm about to go to the field tomorrow. Done with that, okay. Got me a mouse pad finally for my desk area to fix this carpal tunnel and stuff. So that way when your girl edits, I can be nice and comfortable with my mouse pad. And I really want to open this just so I can charge it. This is the one that I went with. They're all seven bucks in there. This one just looks cool. And it's kind of more portable because it's a bit smaller. This one ends up looking better in my room because the black and gold, if I ever keep it in my room or wherever I use it, it just looks nicer. So we'll charge it up and give it a test and see how it actually works. field hockey whatever she just launched the ball and threw it at her mom's side i know that hurt so bad she was so mad but yeah let me get back to this this little warm-up whatever it is i'm trying to be doing i couldn't keep a straight face with that when i had to come back and tell y'all We're in Target looking at some games. We gotta prepare for game night. This is cool. You guys gotta uh, rake the worst case scenarios in order and your friends have to get as close as possible to you. We're just finding all kinds of different random ones. So we're gonna rack up for game night when we actually have them. But I'm gonna keep looking to find other ones. I'm looking at this and I wanna see what the danger game is. Comment below if you guys actually have an idea of a game or if you see one here that you think I should try. What's up, y'all? Finally made it back to talk to y'all for a minute. So this week, few weeks, or however long it's been, has been like a reset for me in a way to get myself back right. Your girl has been like, I don't know, drained, tired, and then just trying to get back in a schedule. And like I said, with a lot of the cleaning and things that I was doing, trying to get my hair right, I was trying new styles and stuff, which by the way, I washed out last night because it came out super cute. But for some reason, when I use that gel, I get headaches. And I don't know if it's just my hair thickening or what, but it was giving me a headache. And it's crazy because I'm trying to like, like I said, balance everything, work, life, health, and all that. So speaking of work, I was able to start working again. It felt good because the weather finally broke. You saw me going to the park and all that stuff. It was feeling good. And then the heat decided to creep back up again. Like, I don't, I don't know. I thought we were getting close to fall. I was cracking jokes on the people, the summer babies. Summer people, y'all still got it, I guess, because it has been hot lately. I'm talking about going back up to high 90s. Other states, it might not be as hot compared to you, but Virginia, it's it still feels pretty hot. And I can't go outside and work like that. Like, 
and I swear, I, okay, I shouldn't say I swear, but it, I felt like it was the heat that kept raising my pressure because my pressure has been super good, even super, super low one day. And to one day, I kind of felt it maybe creeping up. I wasn't feeling as good, but it wasn't like crazy high. I just felt some, maybe a little symptoms from it. But coming to find out, I don't even think it's so much because of the pressure. I think it was more, um, I don't want to say the pressure, but you know, yeah, I wouldn't say so much the pressure, but it's more so when it's the heat it's more of me being dehydrated i don't think i was drinking enough and i realized i gotta have at least about four or five bottles minimum and that's when i kind of feel okay like i did that yesterday to kind of reset my body and i felt good again i woke up my pressure was low so i felt good i took time off of the computer but today i was editing this video like crazy trying to get it out i've been on there for hours so if my eyes are a little cockeyed one's drifting one way that way you guys know what it is they're, they're trying to refocus right now and the sun is in my eye which the sky looks beautiful it looks like heaven's gates are opening right now i don't even think i can capture it on the camera the way it looks but um yeah so just balancing that and i think i'm i don't know the work has been different i'm finding new ways of working again i'm getting back into baking again i have an order to do so maybe this is just my outlet from some of my other jobs to be able to kind of like stop that and do my baking again um i'm in school right now not like school school but i'm doing a course which i will elaborate on later like i said i'm trying to work on keeping things not private but just letting them be in the works and let it happen first before i announce anything not saying you guys are doing it but certain things when they're put out in if you say the atmosphere or whatever you know the enemy might try to do some some try to set some stuff up to try to destroy it if you know what i mean but um, speaking on that, um, like I said, I'll show you guys, tell you guys that later. I've been trying to balance all areas of my life. Like I've been getting back into my word, praying, like spiritual, you know, working on my walk in faith. And um, I feel like I wanted to share some of that. I know some people do like no shade to some other creators, but sometimes I feel like I don't want to criticize or judge anyone because like I said, I'm working on my faith. I don't know what they do or anyone else does, but I feel like it's kind of become a lot of a trend with certain things, people posting um their bible studies and reading and j just different things in scriptures not saying that anyone can't post it because that's great for you guys getting into it but i felt like more people have been doing it just because of the trend and for me right now i'm working on my personal relationship and i don't want it to feel like i don't want to share you know god or my religion or anything with anyone else which is a good thing to share but i feel like i want to get myself right and tell you guys you know good things from what i learn interpret and go through and things like that to be as a witness to others which i'm showing you guys little things in the glimpse if you haven't seen but that's just my opinion if you guys want to see some things on there i won't mind posting like little things like you've seen i've been posting little scriptures you know i've been working on different things like as far as music too changing some of the music not just in my video but really the music that i listen to personally like less of worldly music in a sense and i've been finding a whole lot more christian artists which are like you know it's really good because after all the stuff that's been coming out in the media you've been hearing about all these artists and things like that it's just been crazy so i've been slowly drifting away from it and like i said i'm just working on my my own walk i'm being completely honest i still listen to some music and if i do i try to listen to some that you know don't have a bad message behind it and i feel like that's okay as long as it's not pulling you into those areas if that makes sense but you know it's still a learning process so i'm not perfect with anything i'm just sharing you know my experiences with you guys and i feel like i have a lot of things planned that i want to do and i'm just letting things happen and fall in line basically that's all i'm doing and everything's working out great i feel i'm feeling a lot better even though i was feeling like off yesterday not feeling too well i'm back today like and i feel great today so that, that's really good i'm glad i'm getting this video out for you guys because youtube was slowing down again for a minute i don't know what the heck was going on but like i said i just been focusing on myself and the rest let it matter whoever i reach i reach it's for a reason and i know god will help me grow later on when the timing is right so like i said right now i'm just getting myself together and sharing my journey for those of you who are interested in it a different perspective and it's like i said it's just my overall i can't say it enough it's just my journey showing you guys so if you guys like what you see you can give it a thumbs up and comment below and let me know and subscribe to the channel turn on the post notification bell you guys know the drill already and if you have don't forget to just give the video a like if you do because even just a simple thumbs up helps the channel helps the person the creator whoever's you know whoever you're watching it helps us out a lot and especially with the comments we get to interact with you guys so it's like i don't know the concept of recording on a phone by yourself some people may think is weird but it's like 
when you're doing it for a purpose like i know i'm talking to you guys right now so it's not weird it's like we're on facetime right now but yeah it's like i'm talking to you guys so i need a little bit of feedback i gotta hear what you guys are saying back to me after what i say if you, you feel what i'm saying but yeah i'm supposed to be going to the store right now i'm parked right now to go ahead into the store real quick and get some chicken wings i'm gonna make some more wings we made um cilantro lime rice yesterday and glazed carrots i have a little bit of rice but i know i gotta make some more rice and i'm just gonna make like baked turkey baked chicken wings i'm sorry baked chicken wings again because that's something that i've really been enjoying and yeah i don't know if i hit the gym today or not we'll see i want to go on a little walk again but right now my main focus is getting this video out for you guys because i feel like i don't i don't want to say i've been slacking but i've been slacking i'm trying to push some stuff out for the rest of um august to get things going again because you know your girl's birthday is in september and we might have some other things in store but but yeah that's all i have for you guys for now so i'll catch you guys in the next video again make sure you like the video and share with your friends and i'll catch you guys on the next video like we always do